Good morning. So I just finished two hours of analysis and uh, came for a quick walk here. Uh, surprisingly, it's not that cold today and temperatures are going to drop soon this week here in Zurich. Today's morning vlog is about table one. Have you seen table one before in uh, any research article if not yet then pick up a clinical research study and you will see that there is a table one usually table one has uh, descriptions about participants characteristics so the data usually contains details like bmi age mainly the demographic stuff and sometimes it can also have some questionnaire scores that the researchers collected what I wanted to talk about table one here is that um, many a times I've seen people report mean plus minus standard deviation, but this is relevant only when your data is distributed normally. Now, what happens if your data is not distributed normally? What one would do is to first of all, check the distribution of the data, which is really important and then one needs to decide for an alternative to that parametric test. So one would then ideally apply a non-parametric test, which could be a Mann-Whitney U uh, test. One would apply Mann-Whitney U test. And in that, the results that you would report will be in terms of median and interquartile range and not in mean <coughs> plus minus standard deviation. So that is something that I wanted to highlight. And uh, I hope this video was helpful for you.